The complete graph of the function f is shown in this picture above for which value of x uh, is the value of f of x at its minimum. All right, so this is the entire graph. We have a piecewise function broken up into several parts. It starts here, it ends here no matter what. And the number, so basically, I guess, I don't know, I'm looking at this problem and saying this is way too easy, but maybe they just want you to be careful here. My minimum is at this point right there, which is negative three, two. So my negative three, I'm sorry, negative two. So my minimum value is negative two, but it occurs when X is negative three. And that's what they're asking for. What is the value of X going to be at its minimum? Well, the X value is negative three. And the y value or the f of x value is going to be negative two. So I guess they just, this problem, the trick behind it is they're expecting a lot of people to say that the answer is going to be negative two because, quote, the minimum is negative two, which is, also, which is true, but it happens at negative three. So I guess be careful. <laughs>